Rapido 9048DF, this is a 2007 built on the Fiat Ducato 2.3 JTD engine. Welcome to We Buy a Motor Caravan, don't forget to hit like below and subscribe to our channel. So, this is just over 6.5 metres, it's on the 3.5 tonne as standard, but this has got the 3850 chassis. The standard it's also 420 kilograms in payload. As you can see it is an A-class, I-class it is a 5 berth, but most classes are 4 berth, but I'll show you that inside. So walking down the side, as you can see, Fiamma awning, gas low in the, uh, in the gas bottle locker, which can fit too. Under here, you've got a nice drawer that comes out, and I'll see if I can pull that now. Sorry, I'll pull it up. And I know the camera can't see this, but it goes all the way through to the other side, so you can open up, and it is one hell of a big locker, a wet locker, whatever you want to call it under there. Behind, we've got the Troom event, hookups and toilet and then we've got the electric step and the door at the rear it's a bit of a quirky layout but like I said I'll show you that when we get inside so on the near side of this vehicle you can see at the back you've got a roof rack and ladder twin bike rack and reversing sensor at the bottom and there is a reversing camera at the top again we have got the cassette toilets on this side water infill fridge vents above as well a couple of nice windows you can see there was a nice big window on the lounge on the other side and then we have got the, the cab door, only on this side, not on the other side, but at least you've got one of the two. And then you've got your diesel and the other side to that locker below, as well as under seat storage. Let's go and have a look inside. OK, so here's the quirky bit. You've got an end kitchen in this A-class. Most of them do come with a fixed bed at the rear and a bit of a garage, but this is what we've got in this. So starting in the lounge right here, we have got two forward facing seats with belts. Now this table does drop down and you have got some filling cushions in the cupboard at the back which means you can make this into a double bed. It's a small double but narrow double bed but it's probably a standard sort of motorhome size and then on the other side we have got another long single which for me you can class as another single bed. So that's why I get the five berth from this even though it is classed as a four. Plenty of lockers overhead and a nice big skylight in this living room as well as we can see as we pan around and then in the rear we do have this nice almost wrap around kitchen um, which I shall show you in the next frame but on the on the right hand side you can see there's a nice big Dometic fridge storage above oven at the back as well as lots of lockers and a big wardrobe at the rear which I said which is where the filling cushions are stored for the lounge itself so as you can see from this angle in the kitchen as you look down you've got cupboards below You've got a sink with mixer tap just above, nice cover for that, and then you have got the three hob burner as well. Just in the kitchen we also have the Truma heating controls, so this has, this has got the Truma heating vents, and we have the Rapido control panel just above the habitation door. And then in the rear corner we do have this nice spacious bathroom, we've got a cassette toilet, nice steel looking sink storage and window you've also got a mirror on the right hand side as well and then we do have this sh separate shower compartment again hot and cold water as you'd expect in something like this rapido 120 litres of fresh water or 100 litres of wastewater as we said outside the cab it is built on the Fiat Ducato 2.3 JTD engine with 130 brake horsepower nicely laid out with it being an A class you do have windows on both sides, the, the one on the left is automatic or you don't want to switch. Now you've got a reversing camera on the right hand side with a screen and reversing sensors just above. Pioneer speakers into the cab area as well. Fiat Ducato 2.3, six speed gearbox, reverse cab air conditioning, cab uh, cruise control, 12 volt sockets, pretty much everything you want from this area. So with the lounge area, we do have this nice big table in the middle, which is what you really want. So you can seat, several people around this at lounge area it is a really big spacious lounge there's not many as big as this to be honest it does fold over so you can get everybody around it everybody eating now to finish off with the last couple of berths we do have this fixed drop down bed which is you know pretty much standard across the a, a classes it's seat buckled in press to release and then it folds down and you've got your curtains around with the skylight above so yeah so what do you think comment below like the video and subscribe and we should see you again soon.
hey, you made it to the end of the video. Please press subscribe at the bottom or like if you're on our Facebook and watch the latest news and motorhome reviews. To find out more information, you can go on our website www.webuyanymotorcaravan.com. Telephone us on 01283 240 237.